Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh We are from group 2 and we are going to explain about subject of value added tax and luxury goods sales tax First, I'm going to introduce the members of our group Our group consists of Chandra Kirana, Rahela Anissa, and Siti Amara The first material will be explained by Rahela Anissa Goods are tangible, which according to their nature or law can be in the form of movable or removable goods and intangible goods Taxable goods are the goods that are taxed under the VAT law of 1984. What is meant by intangible taxable goods are a. the use or right use copyright in the field of literature, art, or scientific work, patents, designs or models, plans, formulas or secret processes, trademarks or other forms of intellectual or industrial property rights or similar rights. b. the use of or the right to use industrial, commercial, or scientific equipment or equipment. C. Providing knowledge or information in scientific, technical, industrial, or commercial fields. D. Use or right to use motion picture films, films or videotapes for television broadcasts, or sound tapes for radio broadcasts. E. The waiver in whole or in part of the rights relating to the use or granting of intellectual or industrial property rights or other rights as mentioned above. F. Providing additional or complementary assistance in the connection with the use or the right to use the rights referred to in letter A, the use or right to use the equipment or equipment referred to in letter B, or the provision of knowledge or information referred to in letter C in the form of the first one, acceptance or the right to receive image recordings or sound recordings or both, which are distributed to the public via satellite, cable, fiber optic or similar technology. Uh, two, the use or right to use image recordings or sound recordings or both for television or radio broadcast, broadcast or transmitted via satellite, cable, fiber optic or similar technology. And three, use or right to use part of or all of the radio communication spectrum. Next is BKP Bebas PPN. Some strategic goods can be exempted from VAT. This refers to Government Regulation Number 31 of 2007 concerning the import and delivery of taxable goods which are more strategic in nature and can be exempted from the imposition of VAT. Those strategic goods are Installed or decomposed factory machinery and equipment, excluding spare parts. Raw materials or food for poultry, fish, and other livestock. Agricultural, plantation, animal husbandry, fishery, forestry, and captive products. Seeds or seeds from agricultural, plantation, animal husbandry, fishery, forestry, and captive breeding products. Silver raw materials in the form of grains or bars. Raw materials for banknotes and coins. And clean water distributed by the PT Water Company. Also electricity, except housing with a power of more than 6,600 watts. Basically, all goods are BKP, unless the law stipulates otherwise. The types of goods that are not subject to VAT are stipulated by a government regulation based on the following groups of goods. First is crude oil. Second is natural gas, excluding natural gas such as LPG which is ready to be consumed by the public. Third is geothermal. Fourth, asbestos, slate, semi-precious stone, limestone, pumice, gemstone, bentonite, dolomite, and felt spa. So I'm gonna continue the explanation. The fifth one is coal before being processed into coal briquettes. The sixth one basic goods needed by large amount of people or society. So there are rice, grain, corn, sagu, soybean, salt, iodized or non-iodized, meat, fresh meat without processing, eggs, unprocessed eggs, and milk. Dairy milk, whether it has gone through a cold or heat process, doesn't contain added sugar or other ingredients and or is packaged and not packaged. The next one is jasa kena pajak. So the definition is any surface activity based on engagement or legal action that causes goods, facilities, or rights to be available for use, including service carried out to produce goods, 
due to orders or requests with materials on interactions from the customer. The taxable services are services that are taxed under the 1984 VAT law. The next one is JKP exception. Under the law, the services that are not subject to tax are as follows. The first one is medical health services. It includes of health expert services, midwifery services, paramedics, doctors, nurse, hospital services, psychologists, alternative medicine, and health laboratories. The second one is social services. It includes of orphanage services providing assistance in accidents and providing the funeral activities. The third one is mail delivery with postage. The fourth one is insurance and financial service. The financial service include of collecting funds from the public in the form of demand deposits, time deposits, certificate of deposit, savings, services for placing funds, financing and dispersing loans on the basis of the law of pounding. The next one is religious and education service. It includes of services for houses of worship, giving da'wah or khutbah, organizing school and out-of-school education. And the next one, arts and entertainment services. Next one is non-advertising broadcasting services, land, water and air public transportation services, labor services, hospitality services, parking service provision, public telephone service, services provided by the government, money transfer service by postal money order, and catering services. So that sums up our presentation today. Thank you for your attention. Now we're going to the Q&A session. Thank you.